So, what really happened last night? So, we were all having a good time. We were dancing, we were drinking, we were just having a great time. Okay. You know the night before, Bonnie and Darius Got already had it. a little right. scuffle. They already had drama. What started it was Vani asking if we could help find his phone. We got to find, well, saying, well, we got to find my iPhone phone. We can't find phone. When he said that, <laughs> something just triggered Darius to say, bitch, use find my iPhone. <laughs> <laughs> And I think it just kind of unfolded in, in the most craziest way. picked to be on the bad boys club season eight and i'm feeling so many emotions i'm happy i'm nervous i'm fucking i'm just ready ah. period karan so i'm so excited and i look forward to having a good experience what's up i'm here i literally got the news being on the cast of season eight and all I gotta say is I am so ecstatic. I was at work and literally saw the email. Jaw dropped to the floor. I'ma see y'all in the house. And hopefully you guys are ready to see what I am about. Ah shit, young nigga done made it on season eight. Gonna pop my shit, pop a nigga in his shit. You know what I'm saying? Turn up. Gonna have a good time, gonna mingle, see what there is to do in the set where we popping out at. Shit. I'm roll, I had to pull over real quick because I got this notification from Gemini fans, and I just know damn well, hold up. Congratulations, you have been selected the top five. Man, what the fuck, man? Hold on now, it's out of 100 boys. Man, what the fuck? So I'm on the show. <laughs> man, y'all boy is not ready to see me on this shit, man. I'm finna act the fool for real. You know 
how we do, baby. Kick back, what up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Next time we let them know something. Yeah. Where my dogs at? Ball, ball, all of my dog, ball to the dance. Yeah, I'm winning it all, money to power and the respect. Yeah, uh, run me my check. Yeah, ooh, I'm one of the best. Uh, yeah, running it up, coming correct or I come at your neck. My name is Diego. I am 27 years old. I am from Albuquerque, New Mexico, but I live in Texas now. I'm actually very humble. I grew up poor. So I will never judge you from your background or where you came from. I'm a Leo, so you know I'm a natural born leader. Um, I get attention. I don't seek it, which is funny because I automatically get attention. I walk into a club, I'll have people walking up to me from everywhere asking what my name is, asking who I am. I don't seek the attention. Do I love it? Hell yeah, I love it, but I don't seek for it. I just get it. I feel like I have all my shit put together, but I also turn up at the same time and I'm still trying to figure life out, work on myself, grow. I just do me. And I don't really don't care. My lifestyle is a lot different from a lot of people I know. And I don't really care what people think about me, you know, it's just me. So back in Austin, I used to party a lot. Um, a couple months back, when me and my husband had like an open, open marriage, we didn't have a boyfriend just yet. Um, I was doing a little too much in Austin as well. I feel like I'm known for good reasons and bad reasons. I don't know, I feel like I was damned if I did, damned if I didn't. Like, either I was stuck up for not talking to guys, or I was a hoe for talking to guys. And it was, it was always something. I was not like able to go to the clubs for a minute because I was getting into too many fights in the clubs in, in Austin. It was just always a bunch of drama and I feel like me and a lot of gay people don't click. That's why I'm also here to work on that and see where like my bubble of friends, like if it could expand to like more gay people, not just the straight friends, you know, more gay community. Oh shit. Am I really the first one here? The club? Then I come in, I'm like, I'm the first guy. I'm like, really? Where's everybody at? I was expecting not to be the first guy I came in. I was like, holy shit. Made it to the top fast Went and got my money right And all these hoes got mad I tell them bro don't hate on me Cause I ain't you And if I wasn't myself I'd probably hate me I'm Jacob I'm from Dallas, Texas Born and raised And I'm a bad boy Cause at the end of the day I'ma pop my shit Regardless of what it is Popping shit is my shit So I'ma do it I just live life by my own rules Do as I please And if anybody got a problem with it That's on them I'm very family oriented Family friend oriented I love the people that are in my life My circle I need to work on my attitude Because like I said I don't care a lot of the time So I am quick to pop shit I am quick to Overdo shit You know what I'm saying I am a little dramatic You know what I'm saying Go big or go home I'm from Texas I'm real passionate for doing hair, so like braids, I do wigs, installs, sew-ins, all types of stuff. Like I'm very, and I like to do, get my hands working, so I do hair. The reward for me, of course, you know, I'm gonna get a bag, but seeing the, the joy I bring somebody when their hair is done, when they look and feel their best, and then they live in that and they're basking in that in the mirror, looking at themselves, that's my reward out of what I do. Just seeing how, I can make somebody's day by doing their hair when they're done being like, you look good, girl, like, do your shit. What's up, shit? Uh, oh, bro, what, what you doing? Good. What's up, man? Diego, nice to meet you. Check up. Diego, nice to meet you. Uh, let me get a free. You ready? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Where are you from? New Mexico, you? Here. Oh, Texas, nice, that's nice. Well, literally. Well, before, hey, before you go, let's take a shot first. What you Take a shot, I got Malibu, bro. Fuck it. You ready? Oh, yeah. Hey, Bible stuff is innate. Right. What's going up? I was already shit faced. I was trash by the time he got home. He wasn't drinking what I wanted, but I had my bottle of Hennessy, so I was willing to take a shot. Shit, it's season eight, day one. Shit, I see where he was coming from with the lit shit. Lit, lit. All right, go to the room, see. See what's up. See what's up. I got that bed over there already. That one's taken. That one. Yeah, that one. What a master at. Hey, I, bro, I was looking at the same shit, but there's no master. I'm gonna have to, only because it's my color, you know what I'm saying? I'll put on for the set. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna go ahead and get one of these big beds. Yo, a blue one or what? Yes, yeah. sir. Got to, got to. 
the house is fat, the crib nice. No tea, no shade, but I did get the biggest room with the walk-in closet and the bath, so. Season eight, boy. Fuck yeah. First two, they don't know where hit him. what's up? Hey, this is a nice little house. That person in the fucking fridge, cause. My name is Alexander Galan, I'm 23, I'm from Dallas, Texas, and I'm a bad boy because I stand on everything I do, even though I might be a man of a few words, I stand on mine. I feel like I'm a bad boy because I look good, I like to make money, I work hard for everything I have, I like to have fun, I like to party, I like to drink, I like to do a lot, I just, I'm very open, I, very, I like to experience new things, I'm not closed-minded, um, I get what I want most, most of the time. I don't empathize people. I think that's a problem. Growing up, I've always been like bullied because I've always been quiet. So I've always been taken as a weak person or a target because I did usually not say anything. And I started, you know, standing up for myself. And coming here, I want to open up to people and not to be so closed off and be antisocial like I've always been. I feel like I was, I've was i been very gotten to be closed off because of I grew up being bullied so I've always been like scared of human interaction because I always felt like I'm gonna get bullied over who knows what. But I did come here to open up, be social, make friends, and experience and take it from here. No ways out. Why live it? Who knocked on my dead police? Hey, what's up, bro? What's your name? Diego. Diego. Nice to meet you. Meet you, bro. You're the third one here. I know. You ready for you. a shot? So, actually, but prior to the show, I didn't know we had got casted together, but I did know of him prior to this. Like we, we're both from here, both from different sides of the city. But the nightlife is a very small child. Let me tell you, everybody knows everybody. Like you're bound to meet a few people out there, and I, I've been out there a few times. So we have ran into each other. Circles are very small, so friends of a friends type. But yeah, so I was excited to see him here. Like very okay. A familiar face made me feel more comfortable too coming in the house. Lotta. What's your name? Clear liquor on the table. Uh, bro, you just told me I already fell. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm, I'm a drunk I'm already? I'm a fucking drunk already? Bro, I'm a mess, bro. <laughs> Alright, cheers. cheers. Season 8. Season 8, fuck yeah. <laughs> that one was a little. That one hit me. Meeting Diego, it's. I mean, me personally, I'm Mexican, so I thought, hey. We're going to vibe on the heritage. We're both Hispanic, so I was excited. So the house was amazing. I pulled up. Great experience. There was liquor. There was everything ready for us. The guys, I like them. They were really cool. All of them were down. So far. So I think because we know each other and we are both from here, I keep it low key, key key, and see how it plays out. Cause I don't want to be singled out. Cause we do know of each other. We are both from here. So I think it's just a smarter see how everybody plays out, everybody's intentions, everybody's motives coming in the house, and just see what's up. I was thinking the same thing. Yeah, I love to throw a little spice in it. Cause at the same time, like I didn't want nobody to feel like because we did know each other prior to this and we are coming in the house. I didn't want nobody to ever feel like for whatever situation that, that it was any type of ganging up or nothing. So I did want to keep it hush hush that way. We could just see how everybody moves in the house as a whole, not just us or them or whatever the case may be. See how it is, see how everybody feels about everybody. So that's why we wanted to keep it more hush hush. See, see what it gives. Oh boy, he getting drunk. He's drunk. I gotta watch my liquor around now. I don't know nobody, I don't know. So. So, I'm just... Drink, drink, drink. I'm just gonna play it out, see how everybody feeling. You know, I see you already picked a room with me, so we're safe there. I think it's just smart to see how everybody come in and see where everybody vibe is. I mean, yeah. we already know 
what it is. I mean, we're both from the city. We know how it goes. So, yeah. as long as you're down to say the loyalty is between us and see what it, how everybody play out, then I'm down. Cause I don't want nobody coming acting a fool. You know I'm loyal. Like it's day one though, so we'll see how it gets. But I like them all so far. And let's turn up. Bad Boys Club season motherfucking eight. Woo! It could get real scandalous real quick. After five hours of traveling, I finally made it to Dallas. I just got off the airplane, um, and I'm just tired. I'm tired and exhausted. My body is strained. What am I? So what makes you a bad boy? What you think? Why, why are you a bad boy? Because I don't give a fuck. Why else? I, so just that, that's it. And ain't nobody gonna tell me how to do my shit. I think. Yeah, I just don't give a fuck to be honest. What about you? What makes you a bad boy? Mm, I look good. I work hard for everything I have. Okay, okay, okay. Same, but I got my shit together. I like I party. Yeah. I got my bills paid, cars paid off. You know what I mean? I got my mortgage. I have a house. I just got out of the army, so like I got my shit together. That's what, that's what makes me a bad boy. You know what I mean? I'm taking. I'm in a relationship. Same. I got two. I got a husband, so you know. Damn, yeah. he say he, he live a double life. Yeah, shit. Like yeah I, I do poly, so. Okay, okay, okay. Right. How they feel about you coming here? They like, I mean, they're like, well, go have fun, do you? I'm like, fuck, I hope I don't like do something stupid, though, you know what I mean? I'm like, damn. I mean, you are married. Like, I mean, no, married. but so between me and him, bro, like, if we don't have a boyfriend, we're like open. So I do whatever the fuck I want, he does whatever the fuck he wants, you know what I mean? So I do have a poly relationship. I have a husband that I've been with for like decades. And uh, we recently just got a boyfriend, you know, we've had exes before, but it's not like this one. He's different, you know, and it just kind of happened, like one thing led to another, you know, and we like the lifestyle. Not a lot of people agree, not a lot of people like it, but I feel like it's for me. I like it, I enjoy it, you know. I, I think you could show your love to two people at the same time. You know, maybe even three, I don't know, but for now, just two. <laughs> Where are you trying to hit tonight? Oh. Down for whatever, Cause we still got, there's only three of us. So we still got four more people we waiting on. We gotta see how their vibes are. I'm Darian, I'm from Buffalo. Um, I am a bad boy because I'm just super authentic no matter where I am, who's around, and what's happening. That's just, that's just me. I'm gonna speak my mind. If I'm, feel, if I'm feeling any type of way, I'm gonna bring it up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna speak on it. If you don't like it, then, you know, beat my ass or shut up. That's just how I feel about it. It is what it is. Like, I'd rather talk it out. I'm not gonna let anybody disrespect me in any way, shape, or form. That's just, that's not happening. Please don't let the pretty face fool you. Please don't. <laughs> These hands work. And they work well. I'm a real estate agent. I've been in real estate for about two years now, and I love what I do. I love the satisfaction of having my clients happy from getting their offer accepted. I just, I just love my career. I got into real estate when I first bought my house. I bought my house in 2020. From there, I got super cool with my real estate agent, and I kind of just asked her like the, the, the ins and outs about real estate. From there, it was history. <laughs> Hello. Oh, Hello. Hi. Hi. How are you? What's your name? Darian. Diego, nice to meet you. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, bro. Yeah, you go. You go. You go. <laughs> All right. Um, clearly got a lot of shit. Yeah, you go. <laughs> this is well, cute. We first. Well, we doing first. We're taking a shot first. Oh, of course. That's what I was coming to do. It's cute in here. So when I first see this house, I'm like, this is a major upgrade from the prior seasons. I'm like, this is how you know we're gonna be the best season because these bitches ain't had all this. So when I first walk into the house, I meet this cowboy and he offers me a shot and I'm just like, okay, he's cool. I'm thinking, at first I'm thinking he's from Texas. I thought he was definitely from the South. I'm, that's my bed over there. There's no one there. So when I first walk in, um, I seen Cowboy had the first room, which was the yellow room. I initially was going to go to that room until I seen the blue room and the master bathroom and the two boys that were in the, the master bedroom. Is that a new bad boy? That is, bro. A new bad boy right here. Hello. Hey, Hello. what's up? Jacob. Darian, it's nice to meet you. Alex. I give my hug. I give my hug. Oh, guys, guys. How are you? How are you guys here? I've been here a while. I like your style. I like that we vibe. He's not loud. He's very much a person I would hang out with outside. 
of here. Oh, this is very good, like the white marble. Yeah. I'm a real estate agent, so you know I'm checking everything out. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. What well, happened? I thought you wanted the bed. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 He's quite like a common man. Come to New York and I got it. I need more privacy though, because you know what I mean? Second house in Dallas is hot. Dallas is expensive too. It's not cheap out here. New York City, the actual city is too hectic for me. It's a little bit much. I feel like literally instantly I clicked with them. Like it was like love at first sight, so to speak. And I moved into their room and history. Hello, I haven't started yet. I haven't even came in for us. I have a Period. Bad boy CNA. Bad boy CNA. What the fuck? Yo, Urkel in the building. We are though. For real though. Original. Original. The first four. The first. Buddy, we are just now leaving to head to Texas. We are here at the airport. I'll see y'all soon. First four, the fantastic. Wait, are y'all feeling me though? Uh, I thought y'all feeling me. You feeling me? Of course. You promise? I promise. Okay. You feeling me? Yeah. You feeling me? Um, you feel as of right now. As of right now. As of right now. Yeah. I, I think. Yeah. Thank you. Y'all feeling me? Y'all feeling me? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know you. <laughs> no, but from what, like the Swan Rash, y'all feeling me though? Like, yeah. 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 We good? We good? We good? Right yeah. I didn't know there was any animosity. I didn't think there was. Like I didn't really know him. We spent all of one hour. So unnecessary. It was just. It, it's nothing to quarrel about, to be honest. In my opinion, it was. It was stupid. Y'all wanna go to the hot tub? That's why I'm like, we're going to the hot tub. I'm not right now. I mean, we're going to maybe pause. Why the hell? Why would I be hot right now? Because uh, later in the day, I want to go. Maybe at night. Later at night. Later in the night, I want to go. I'm, I'm waiting. Like, it's cool. It's too hot. I kind of want Wait, to the sun's still out? Fuck it. You're going to get in the hot tub? Yeah. Right now. Naked. Naked. <laughs> Booty ass naked. Birthday yep. suit naked. Well, let's take a shot. Salud. We need to give him a world. Salud. You know, right Where's your shot? Catboy decided to go ahead and get naked in the jacuzzi the very first night. I was like, okay, bro. I mean, you do what you want, but that's a little bit much for me. I don't... I'm not showing my goodies to... You the entire America the first night. Sorry, that's not happening. But if you want to do that, that's you. Since I know it's cold in New York, did you expect oh. this? No, I looked at the weather and said it was going to be cool. Jacket. Ah, this is a oh. Yeah, here it be like up and down. Like tomorrow's going to be cold. Well, I brought the multiple mostly. like Texas is options. like our women. What is they it? don't know what they're going to be. <laughs> we hold this for me. I got to go. Oh, you get it? Oh my God. He's really good again. <laughs> Rock that hot tub. Yeah. You're wild. I love it. Love it. <laughs> we haven't even been here full two hours. It's not even a day yet. <laughs> How does it feel? I ain't getting in. That's a hot tub is for later in the day. Yeah, when it gets cooler. <laughs> when it gets cooler, exactly. I was telling everybody to get in the pool with me and get naked, but I feel like they didn't want to do it because it was just day one. They're trying to feel the vibe, you know what I mean? I was being too much. I was very out there. And they're like, who the fuck is this guy? All my cousins when they pull up get the bluffing know your bitches started running so my name is justice i am from atlanta i'm 22 years old and i am a model as well as a model agency black owned business owner what makes me a bad boy is that my confidence um pretty chill and laid back but i love to have fun like i love to party i'm pretty laid back so like i'm not the type of person to really like pick a fight for the most part but when i do get into some drama i get fired up and yeah i can handle my own but i really think it's my mouth that gets me disrespectful i'm a type of boy who lives in the moment i stand on what i say i'm not over here trying to be the best bitch but i know just based off my confidence i know i'm that bitch i'm a confident person and i think that's what a bro boy is
So when I walked in and I seen Diego, I was like, this how you come in already? Already? But I mean, hey, I don't judge. Look, do you. I wasn't taken back to it. I was just like, okay, he's probably in this bitch. He's probably turned lit as fuck. And I'm just like, okay, I'm gonna get like you, but bitch, I'm not about to strip. Man, you boy? Worth it. Ah. Oh. Oh. They just keep getting taller. <laughs> Jacob. Justice. He was fun. He's goofy. I like that. I like that we could be goofy and corny together. I do like that. Alex. Alex. Justice. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You're like. I know. But I'm pretty sure it's the boots to be honest. But yeah. That might be it. They just getting taller and taller as they come in. I'm just getting shorter and shorter. <laughs> I might be the tallest one, to be honest. Have you had a room of the house already? I'm good. I'm Why are you mad, friend? I'm not mad. Who the hell is not? Why are you mad, friend? I'm not. Mad. It's good. I was like, I'm I promise we're in the house of this. He keep promising in the house of this. I'm like, I'm by myself. Are you serious? I just didn't want to get in butt ass naked. Don't I don't. Why? I don't do that shit. What does it matter? Cause I got morals. So you have my morals? Yeah, I, I don't want to. I don't want to get in the pool butt ass naked. I do my morals though. Okay, but I don't want to get the pool in butt ass naked. I'm gonna tell you like that. But I was wrong with that though. I, I, I just don't. Okay, you can do that. I'm not going to. I'm not forcing you. Okay, and that, but why are you mad that I didn't? I'm not mad. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. All right. I ain't mad. Okay. Who's that was mad? I just heard. You guys wanna take a shot? You wanna take a shot? Yeah, take a shot. Make you feel better? Who, who, yeah, take a shot. Who's that was mad though? Nobody said you're mad, I just heard. From who? To wing. No. I felt your energy. You seem like you're mad because we didn't get in the tub. We closed on whatever it is. It don't matter. You started, you started. I told you, we all told you we would get in later. I fuck with you. I fuck with you too. That's why I told you I'll get in later. You didn't want to have that. I didn't. I didn't say nothing about that. Okay, so you're fine. Yeah. Okay, so you want to take a shot? I'm down. Okay, let's take a shot. Let's take a shot. Let's just take a shot. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't turn up like that, so I wasn't going to do nothing outside of my comfortability, so I was just not going to do that, but we all turn up in our own way, and that's how he want to do it, go out, so, hey, live your life. He didn't say no to me, I just heard it. I just heard But you just left without saying nothing, that's why I was like. I came to come change. Okay, we just didn't understand what the problem was. No, I'm honest. I want to let you know if I'm upset. You're upset? Your your face? I will let you know I'm upset. Your face screamed upset. I'm just out. I'm honest, I'll let you know I'm upset. I promise you. But your your hand is a little stretching over. But you you are too though, so. Now they are. But I'm, I'm they were not first. Okay, but okay. Everybody's hands in my face. Yeah, we're so, I want to Okay. Yeah, well, that's what I was saying. Well, yeah. But he actually has the bed, so you'd have to take that up with him. But, um, but our third bed. Oh, remember how we? Yeah. Okay. Because he said he wanted a room with us. I'm understanding why your hands is doing all of this traveling. Oh, you did, you did too, though. Be yeah. honest. Right now, I am. Yeah. Yeah, because you started doing it first. Yeah, honestly, I feel like you guys are dragging. Oh, he's a new boy, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a new boy. Fact. That's a new boy. Fact. Let's just take a shot. Let's just take a shot and forget about it. This is going to be the bitch doing the fucking most. And it's going to be doing the fucking most. I ain't going to do shit I don't want to do. Issue. You know, resolve the issue. You promise you're good? I'm fine. You just start talking to me. No, I, I, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm like, oh, look. Uh, I promise you we're good. We're good, so I don't know why you're staying no, so not, close. Not, like you're I doing really it. Because I appreciate you. Yeah. Okay. All right, we can hug it out. It's fine. Yeah. Mm, bathtub later? Yeah, later. Like I said, I'll later. Okay. Show the world you love me masses, we surpassing I'm a freak bitch, trying to fall in love, not sleepless Show me a good time, I got peaches, Georgia, eat this Suck on your neck like leeches, Reese's, pieces Take me on a date to Mars, not bars, flying cars Trying to find love in the world, I know it's hard You just fuck me, then you leave me, baby boy, swipe your car Them bands, 
tryna cop him some Margiela And I never fell off, but I been tryna tell him Got these new kicks on and these bitches feeling great first. And I got it out the mud, being humble really works That's the only way I know, and I put that on my mama He been saving up them bands, tryna cop him some Margiela And I never fell off, but I been tryna tell him yeah, my name is Darius, but better known as D. I'm from Atlanta, Georgia. Can't okay, we'll make me a bad boy because I'm very true to myself. I'm just simply a boss. Like I go get it. I'm self-made and I'm self-paid. I'm a entrepreneur. I got three businesses. I'm a master barber, a spiritual healer, and I own my own adult toy sex entertainment business. Right now, I create lube for that business. I said, I'm a go-getter. I get it. I got it out the mud. I came from nothing and made myself something by myself with no help. None of that. No handouts. No nothing. I follow my own lead. And um, I, each and every day, I try to find a way to better perfect myself than I was the day before. So, that would make me a bad boy. I came here to work on um, like bettering myself with communication with others and being able to get along with people and see how I operate. Being in a, a month. The crowd. What's your name? What's your name? Uh, yeah, but I can meet you, bro. Yeah. Yeah. What is your name? It's just D. A new boy. D. Oh, nice to meet you. Alex. Alright, D. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Jacob. D. Y'all talk. Tall. You don't talk about it, bro. <laughs> what do you drink? Um, anything? Yeah. What's up, Hennessy? Why everybody yeah, saying yeah, they yeah, say yeah, Hennessy? Yeah. D or Darius walks in, and I thought he was very cute. I mean, he's giving trade, he's giving masculine, he's giving hood, and that's my kind of guy. So as soon as I see him, I was like, oh yeah, he's gonna be trouble. <laughs> my insides start squirming a little bit when I see him. <laughs> So when I first walked in, I was like blindsided, hoping I wasn't like gonna be the last person here. But uh, when I got here, the first person I did notice was Darian, because his he had some like beautiful white teeth, so I kind of noticed him. I noticed Diego; he was already like Diego was like already drunk. Like, he was already on edge. What are we doing? Oh, let's have fun. Alrighty. Yeah. 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 No one was giving the energy. I mean, justice was. Me and Justice were partying. But I felt nobody else wanted to party. They don't, they don't want to do anything. So I felt, I felt like they felt like I was being a bully or being extra. But at the moment, I was just living it up. I was having fun, taking shots, doing me. You know, I'm not a bully. I really wasn't. And if it came out like that, I did apologize for my mistake. I was like, you guys know what? Like, that was fucked up. I mean, you're doing that, but I want to have a good time. I want to. I'm here to turn up. We're gonna we're gonna talk with each other. First of all, bitch, what was that earlier? What was that? They're being dumb. Right? <laughs> We're gonna have a chill with roommates. With roommates. Okay. I'm, bro, I'm crazy. Oh, I can tell. I'm, like, I'm taking shots all night. They ain't taking shots. I know it. I love that. They ain't taking shots. I love that energy already. Exactly. I'm saying. I wanna have a good time. I wanna take shots. They're okay. like, oh, no, no, no. I don't do this. I don't take shots. So, what, what you wanna do? Take shots? I mean, bitch, we here. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> but see, that's the energy I need, bro. I'm like, the fuck? That's what. You need to stay right there. Look. Get your bags and put them right there. That's not what I don't know where it's going. It's giving. 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 We're in Bible let's, let's have fun. It's so crazy. Let's yeah. have fun. Let's be like, crazy. Literally, it's crazy because I'm a calm, cool, collective person, but I like to turn the fuck up. That's what I'm and saying, bro. Like, That's what I'm right saying. Now, like, 
right now is giving like But they judging. Yeah. They ain't really judging. Yeah. So I'm like I, to see. I was naked, I was taking shots, or like You know what I mean? Honestly I say be your fucking self. To be fucking honest. So you got me? Oh what you got me? Bitch. Bitch. You wanna get jumped up? Trying to get something. Bitch, now if you put yourself in a situation where you get jumped, <laughs> you are here. Okay. You're like, yeah, I'm saying, yeah. I'm gonna let you have a lot. You're serious, bro. <laughs> nah, I'll play it. I got you. I got you. I wanna let you I got you. Let's go. Alright. Let's go. What's up? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you looking like that? Because you make me nervous. <laughs> I make you nervous? Why? Oh, because I don't know what you're going to say. I don't want to talk to you. This is how you feel. What do you mean? Just about everything. As far as dating wise, uh, I'm necessarily not even like looking right now, and I um, don't think I wasn't expecting nothing too serious. But um, I do see myself kind of um, growing a little bit of feelings for Darian, and that kind of scares me because I wasn't looking forward into like dating. But I think he's pretty cool and cute. I do, I do think that. Um, I think you're cool. I think everybody's cool, but I think you're particularly cool. <laughs> what do you mean by particular? You're cool. Cooler. <laughs> that makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah, he made me nervous a little bit. Why? I'm not thinking cute. I might think the same. Might. I mean, that's your thing. <laughs> I gotta be subtle. I can't give you give you too much credit <laughs> just <Yeah>. yet. <laughs> I'm but. <laughs> Is it because you're drunk? That's why you're saying that? No, 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 no. I'm aware. Are you? Yeah. Are you fully aware? Yes. One hundred percent. Yes. 1,000%. Mm -hmm. I think you promise. You can't break that. I'm not. <laughs> Do you feel like you're feeling this way because of the alcohol? Like you feel like everybody's against you? Yeah, straight up, yeah. Who do you feel like is against you? Like Everybody, oh, everybody. I don't feel like they're like coming at you. I feel like if more of anything, it's just because- It's just everybody's like, I feel like everybody's like just judging me because I'm drunk as fuck. It's not that they're judging you, I just feel like maybe like calm down a little bit instead of drinking the Four Loco, maybe drink the water. But I, it's because, because you're coming up like... How am I? Am I not? No, it's because let not me, everybody... Let me know, let me know, let me not know. Everybody, let me know. Not everybody is as drunk. Uh -huh. And so not everybody has been taking so many shots, so not everybody is on your level. They're not being mean to you. I'm not being mean to you. It's, no, just, not, that's it's just that they may feel like... Yeah. Like just, just calm down. Like I've been, been chill, bro. No, man. yeah, you've been chill, and I fuck with you. Like I ain't trying to take that from you. I'm just saying, like they might be like, oh, he's drunk. You know what I'm saying? Because of the four local. Okay, yeah. yeah, like just, just calm down. You're chilling. Like I fuck with you. I, I ain't got no beef with you. I that they just feel like maybe you're getting a little too late, a little too fast. Yeah. So just, but that's the point. We got totally screwed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Get it's just because you're coming in like, oh, it's bad boy season eight. Oh, finna get turn up, turn up. It is. But they're like, they're like, you know, it's bad boy season. It it's bad boy season eight. I gotta make sure everybody like, I gotta come in on my tens, like, see how everybody else coming, cause you don't want to be True. vulnerable to a whole bunch of guys that like. Now I'm having different are ready to pop on you. You know True. what I'm saying? Yeah. So you gotta be like ready, like, okay, it should pop off if I'm ready to pop on my jacket. I you know what I'm saying? The first day was very overwhelming. So bitch, let me take a nap. I'm tired. I ain't gotta be up there with y'all all the fucking time. Y'all wasn't interesting enough for me to stay up. When Diego came and he asked me to be his roommate, I was like, I mean, hey, you're the first person who's seen me, so Look, I'll be your roommate, why not? He was just telling me how like he felt like an outcast and I was just like, why you feel like that? Like we just we just got here. Like for the most part, like we just got here, but I think what it was, I think it was like the liquor. Like it was the liquor. I think he was like really drunk. Cause when I came in, he he was he was lit. Like I've just never met anybody where it's just like I come in, bitch naked. Like so I was like, oh yeah, you had like you had a lot to drink. We were on the hot tub trying to have a good time. We're taking shots, we're drinking, and I remember Alex going to bed. And I felt I also felt like I was kind of annoyed with him for doing that. I didn't know his personality yet, and he had given a really, really good vibe at first. And I was like, why are you gonna sleep with the babble Let's go, let's turn up, it's day one, let's live it up, you know? And then I walk in the room and I think I woke him up. I did, I woke him up. I don't know, I woke him up and then I felt like the guys took
took that wrong as me being like a bully and be like, get up, get up. But I think I just wanted to have a good time. I think I just wanted everybody to party and bond. I personally felt a type of way because um, Alex was the first one to go to sleep, but he wasn't the only one to mention that he was tired. So I didn't like how other people had spoke up on it and said they were tired and were going to take naps. And Alex actually just went to go take a nap. Both of them felt he should have got up, but... It's still first day. We don't know how anybody is. Yeah, I get it. First day, why are you trying to nap? I get it. But I feel like if they did, at least one of them should have said something. Not both of them be like, well, we both feel. So that's all. That's why I felt like I had to jump in. Plus, he is my roommate. Aside from knowing each other or whatever, we are roomies. So, gotta have a bitch bag. Every time we told you to take a, take a shot of water and you yeah. get it. Now take yeah. it and then let's go. That's what I'm talking about. But how is that bad though? Am I offending you? No, but it's, it's, gross. Like, it's, just like, it's just like, you don't know how to calm down. I don't. And I'm, I'm trying, trying to tell you guys a friend to, to calm up, down. That's what I'm saying. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I'm just not. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I, I'm gonna keep it real. It's me. I'm the problem. Honestly. Okay, look, no, because no, 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 look, and they honestly feel like it's just like energy that's going on. It's just real fake. I'm not gonna fucking lie. I mean, like everybody's cool, but <laughs> so what you mean by that? I don't know. I just feel like okay. Who so, do you think fake? Who do you think? Who you think? Yeah, who you yeah. think fake? So I mean, honestly, I'm not gonna lie. As far as just like. Hearing conversation, like just how like people are acting towards each other. I'm like, okay, everybody's trying to act cool back in the day. Bitch, I know you don't like him. I mean, I it's the, I, I fuck know, with him. I'm genuinely trying to tell I mean, him they need to calm down. Like, it ain't I know, no, know, it ain't no Tino shit. He's not gonna like me. I mean, it's the first day. So I mean, I mean, yeah. I mean, no, I totally understand that, but I'm just over here saying like. No, because at the end, like, like you said, you feel like, but like, you weren't here when we first got with him, and right. when he first threw his fit, you weren't okay. here for that, so you don't know where, how I'm coming off. Okay. You just see what you see. Right. But what I'm telling you is, because when we first got here, did you not? When me, you, and old boy didn't want to get in the pool, he threw a fit right or wrong. He did. Okay, so this, this, this is just coming off the energy he's been given. Yeah, okay. So I'm telling you, friend, just calm down. You don't need right. another shot or nothing. That's, it's not fake. I'm just telling him, like, he's drunk. I'm not being shady. Look, I'm drinking my water. Right. I mean, yeah, So it, it ain't nothing like no beef shit. Like, I'm just telling him, like, friend, you're just calm. Like he said, he's trying to pick up boys from going to sleep. Yeah. He just said he was tired. Why he ain't pick on him? You were don't just pick picking on him. Don't do Because he was sleeping. Don't do that kiki. Like, oh, picking on him because he was sleeping. Hey, this must be the liquor because why are you acting crazy? From the first time you had a problem with us not getting in the jacuzzi. I didn't have a problem with you, though. I didn't have a problem with you. But that's what I'm saying. You didn't have a problem with me or him, but you I had a problem was, with him. Cool. And now that he wants to take a nap, it's a problem again. It's not a problem, though. It's you said he was boring. That's okay, all I said. That's it. That's, it. That's, it. That's a problem. Yeah, that's that's me. No, I just I'm, I'm, I'm just I'm telling you. you what it is. I ain't even gonna call her no fake shit, no nothing like that. I'm, not I'm gonna tell you what it is. Like I said, from the first time we got here from the jacuzzi, yeah. you had a problem. You ain't picking with me. You ain't picking with him. Okay. He wants to go to sleep. He's tired. They want to take naps. He's actually in the bed sleeping. You ain't pick nobody but the boy who's in the bed. Okay. So what's the issue? And like I said, you ain't coming here but last. So we been feel how this, how he moving. You feel me? So for you to say, oh, we being, ooh, 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 he was here for the jacuzzi moment. So he knows what I'm talking about. So I'm not just calling a bluff. Right. So for you to be like, oh, we picking on him. No, I don't. Ben told him, calm down, take some water, drink some water. Yeah, he yeah, don't want to yeah. listen. That's on him. He a grown man. He I'm gonna do what the me. fuck he want to do. I'm I ain't pushing you. nobody to do shit. I'm only going to go back and forth so long. That's why I, after a while, I was just, what can we say to get past this at this point? Because I'm over it. is your favorite Darian from Bad Boys Club Season 8. If you like this episode, subscribe to Gemini Films to see more of me and the rest of the bad boys that are here. So I was waiting for the seventh boy to get here and I felt like, and I wanted to go out and have fun. I felt like we had to, we had to wait on him. So I felt a little annoyed at the fact that, I was really annoyed at the fact that he was like getting, taking his time to get here. 
So my petty ass <laughs> decides to go mess up his bed. I'm not sleep, nigga. Well, <laughs> nah, Russ. What you gotta do? Hello, bro. Yeah, he's on the phone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All night, all night, hell. What are you doing? This is messed up. Why are you doing? Why are you doing? We're here all night. We're here all night. We're here all night. Why do you undo the bed, though? Yeah, why do you undo it? I feel like I should do it. The mess is like driving me insane. I'm gonna fix it. I'm gonna draw the photo. No, no, what you doing? What y'all doing? We're fixing it. Why y'all fixing it? Because what are you messing up with? Yeah. Like, he lied to us. Who lied to us? Who lied to us? He's not even here. I've been here in time, blah, blah. He wasn't here in time. We're here in time. Who said that he said that, though? I don't know. He knows him. Okay, hold on. No fun. I know, like, I'm gonna laugh. See, when Diego messed up his bed, I kind of felt like, okay, now this is gonna determine if I'm gonna like you or not. Because if you're gonna come here and destroy, first of all, you destroy somebody, something that's in my room. It wasn't my stuff, but um, if you're gonna destroy somebody's thing, I was hoping he's staying 10 toes on, on behind it. Because if not, he gonna look like a, a pussy to me. Don't make it be like a repeating factor. It's like, okay, so after this, you're apologizing what you said, and then when we have another private conversation, it's the same thing. And that was the issue. Like that literally was the issue. <laughs> and I got mad, and I told him that straight up. You're not understanding. Like I get you are drunk, but you're not understanding that the way you're making shit like perceive when me and you are having a conversation is not giving what we're up in a group setting at all. <laughs> No, I'm not. I'm not staying in this room because no, you just gotta just give him some time. Give him time. I mean, I can give him some time, but at the end of the day, I know like he's drunk or whatever. Like I understand that a hundred fucking percent. I just say that in the I'm, I'm not. I'm not trying to go up because the way how I feel, like I'm, uh, I'm an energy-based type of person. So like when I'm peeping shit, I'm just like seeing how shit is and like what it's giving right now is giving like this. You basically talking shit about them, but like when you're in their face, it's like, oh, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say that. Like, you know, like, like that's what I'm saying, like, bitch, stay on your shit. Like, I don't fuck with that because it's just like, bitch, be real. Be fucking real. Like, Diego and Justice start getting into it, and the Justice Society wants to move out the room. That caused an argument between D and Justice. You want to have whatever you want to have? That's not me. I don't have an issue with you. I'm just saying, just for you. Hey, D. D. Hey, D. Hey, D. Hey, D. Hey, D. Hey, D. Hey, D. But uh, Justice is going to room with you. That's all. No, 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 not yet. Not yet. No, 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 no. no. Okay, then. We're going to wait till my room ain't here. So the only way I really did feel like that, um, I had the right to um, talk about my room because it was my room. I was in there and who are you to invite somebody into my space? Like, that's just like, I don't know, that's not how you do things. Like I said before, I make the executive decision who comes to my room or not. I didn't care if my roommate would have came in, but I know I wasn't going to be welcoming a new person in my room if that was your original roommate. It didn't make sense to me. So he can decide and they make that decision. Dave, you're just like, it's fine, it's fine. pause, Justin, um, D said you can't room with him. Why? He in the dining room. Miss. No, miss. Yeah, before. Yeah, they can't switch yet because my roommate got to get here first, so he can decide. Then, then after he decides, then I make the decision. So that's how it's gonna. But I already got my room. But wait, why? 
Yeah. Look at us and I sleep in there. So it originally my roommate's decision. So when he make his decision, then I make that decision. Because yeah. therefore, he gonna stay in here with you. So you're, so you're claiming that that's your room? No, it, I mean, basically, yeah, I have to, it's been, but it's been my roommate's room. Y'all already assigned the room. So when he gets here, that's when he make his decision, then he elaborate with me, then I make that second decision. First of all, the roommate is not here. Well, he's gonna be here tonight, later on tonight. And, and you don't make no decisions. So all, we're gonna I'm wait. Gonna, gonna that's your roommate, and we're gonna wait. Like, yeah, I'm not staying in here. Like, the new boy's not here yet, so if anything, in my mind, I'm thinking like, okay, if the new boy comes here, it's not gonna be a problem, like, which bed he gets because he's not here, he hasn't seen the house. It got really heated, and when he told me he was from Georgia, nigga, the, the Georgia boys, Georgia boys get active. I just felt the energy, like, intensify. I'll make my decision. That's right. No, 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 I'll make this decision. No. First of all, as far as, oh, he got to put the room in my room. Honestly, I don't want to be in this room no more. Well, let my room in that decision, man. Let him make the decision. I'm going to be honest, he's here. Well, he's going to be here. Well, I'm here. But he's here. Well, I'm here. Well, I'm here. 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 i am here 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 i am what do you want to do? Like, honestly, but y'all really want this to happen? I'm, I'm just confused. Like, y'all really want this to happen? No, I mean, what, 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 what is the issue? Is, is there an actual issue though? No, it's no issue, but what, what do you want to be? What, on the do you want to be an issue? But, what is the actual issue? And you're taking out your jacket like you want an issue though, for real. You said what? I said you're taking out your jacket like you really want an issue for real though. For me, first of all, you have arm lift. So like, it was the fact that he came a little bit too close to my face. So I'm like, hold up, you're a little too close. And now I'm not not gonna talk at this point. Like, I'm not with the talking. We can explain how we explain, but when you do a little too much and you come to my face, now that's like those like fighting gestures. So no, you're not gonna come too close to me. I wasn't expecting that. Honestly, I was expecting Jacob and Diego to be the first fight because it was getting into it a little bit. So when they started scuffling, I was just like, oh shit, damn. After I seen the first punch, I was like, oh shit, then these motherfuckers really get into it. The first day didn't even been a full 24 hours yet. But I was just happy it wasn't me. <laughs> Hard on! It's not even my lip. Yeah. 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 My bitch is cute. It's cute. Bitch, I'm a G. I know you like it. I need to be ready to 
like get active I have to get active like because that shit was just like I don't deal with people where it feels like I'm being disrespected and like I feel like if you put your hands on me I feel disrespected when injustice and d started fighting i low-key felt a little guilty because i felt like that situation happened because of me i feel like a Justice wanted to get his stuff out of the room because of me, because I was being extra, because I was too much. So that fight was uncalled for, and I felt like that fight was not necessary, and I felt like shit because I felt like I didn't cause it, but it was I was a source in the whole argument that they had. I literally see my lip. I see my lip. I go to the bathroom. I knew like he had hit my lip and when I went to the bathroom, it was like big and then it started bleeding. I was just like, no fucking way this motherfucker just busted my fucking lip on camera. So I was like, hold on. Uh-uh. Like it's, it's not done. Like it's not fucking done. And I didn't even want to have the issue with me, like with you, but the fact that you hit me first, just realized that bitch you have the issue with me. Wow.